All right, so let's practice all the way. So I want you to draw the resonance structures for NO3 minus. Or say the question might be like, draw NO3 minus. I put the, the steps just to remind you. So we're doing the same steps that we've been doing, but we're going from beginning all the way to the end. All right, so I have NO3 minus. The first thing is to figure out who goes in the middle. So I've got N and O. N is less electronegative, so N goes in the middle. So N, O, O, O. Next is to count my electrons. N has five, O has six. So now I add up my electrons. N has five, whoops, I said five, I wrote six. O has six. So when I add that up, that's 23. That should be a red flag. The NO3 minus has a negative charge. So if it's a negative one charge, that means I add one electron. All right, next step, single bonds. Everybody gets bonded. How many bonds? Three. There's two electrons in a bond, so that's six electrons. So that means I only have 18 left. Keep track of your electrons as you go. Next part, make these outside electron, uh, outside atoms happy. He wants eight. He's an oxygen. He wants eight. He has two, so that means he needs six more. So he wants six. He wants six. He wants six. That's 18. I have 18, so I do it. So everybody gets their electrons. Everybody gets their electrons. <coughs> All right, next, nitrogen wants to be happy. He's got two, three, four, five, six. He wants eight, so that means he wants two more. Do I have two more? No, this is why you have to count these. So what do I do? I have to move. So do I need to do formal charge? Not really, okay, not right now. Because this guy, this guy, and this guy are all the same. So I just pick one. So pick one and move the electrons, doesn't matter. So you pick one and you move the electrons. All right, Nitro nitrogen now has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Cool, so now he has eight. So now the next question is, can he have more than eight? Okay, this is, we're getting to that formal charge part. So I have to look and see if he can have more than eight. Nope, can't have more than eight. So this is where I say, this is my final Lewis structure, okay? So now I am done, final Lewis structure. But here's another question I could ask. So I could also ask you, how many resonance structures does NO3 minus have? So how many resonance structures? So then you would say, okay, this isn't a viable structure because he didn't have eight. To make eight, I could have done it here, here or th here. I have three choices, right? And all three choices were the same. So I have three equivalent resonance structures. So another question I might ask is, after you've drawn NO3 minus, I might ask you how many resonance structures does NO3 minus have? And your answer would be three, okay? Because you had three equivalent choices. So this is where you have three equal resonance structures. All right? On the next lecture, we're going to practice drawing another molecule.